It was here on the Mediterranean coast of Spain where the Phoenicians, Greeks and Romans first landed, each in turn, to conquer and spread their empires throughout the Iberian Peninsula. Today, Spain's La Costa Brava, or Wild Coast, stretches 125 miles south from the French border. An area of rugged coastline and sandy beaches, it has become a seasonal destination for vacationing Europeans who head to the small coastal communities to relax by the sea. Despite recent development, much of the magic, beauty and history of the location still exists in a number of attractive seaside towns. Empurias was one of the original Greek colonies of the Empyrean Peninsula with ruins in this area dating back to 600 BC. In addition to its archaeological significance, the area is representative of the many small coastal villages throughout the region. The early conquerors found this coastal area unusually fertile and the name Empurias comes from the Greek word emporium or market. Empurias was a sizable Roman town. Today's version is quiet and relaxed with narrow streets and many 14th century buildings. Perhaps the finest monument in the old town is the Iglesia San Martí de Empurias, a large 13th and 14th century Gothic church The Romanesque bell tower still remains from a previous church constructed on the site. To the south of Empurias is the town of La Scala, known since ancient times for its anchovies. When Julius Caesar colonized the area, the need for fish products proliferated and La Scala developed a reputation for the small salty fish. It is a tradition that has continued to this day. At El Silvio Anchovies, the traditional methods of salting anchovies have been handed down over the generations. From early Roman galleys to sailboats, then steam and diesel, the fleet has been bringing in the anchovies since time immemorial, and El Silvio has been preparing them.